Good morning guys from Interlaken, Switzerland. This part of Switzerland has a special space in my heart. I used to live here and I'm always still coming back every now and then. It's really beautiful here. The nature is just really stunning. This episode, I am going to show you a day in my life. Today I'm gonna bring you with me to Lauterbrunnen. Lauterbrunnen is a very cute uh, village here in the Bernese Alps. Even though it's really famous to visit it for the summer for some hikes and spectacular views, I definitely recommend it actually all year round because it's always a different scenery. Now you can see some snow. You see behind me the Staubach. so amazing we got a lot of rain here recently so the waterfall it's really spectacular right now After enjoying a walk in Lauterbrunnen and I warmed up with a coffee, I was heading to Grindelwald which is a beautiful mountain village and a paradise for winter sport lovers and hikers. December and it's not much snow. Wanted to wanted to come this time actually snowboarding, but it's really unfortunately too less snow. So just going to hike instead and enjoy the sun. I could finally find a parking place and now I am walking down to the Meilichen lift because there is still some sun there up on the mountain so I want to catch the last sun and just grab there a drink. Now I want to go. There is the lift. Quite a while. I haven't prepared actually that I'm gonna have uh, this half an hour walk. I have no clothes and I'm only in my wet shoes, <laughs> not even having winter socks. I used to live here in this area and uh, I was really spending so many hours here up on the mountain. And it's beautiful, not only in the winter for skiing or snowboarding or sledding, but also in the summer 
you can just do some really beautiful hikes here and the scenery is just amazing i don't really feel my toes and fingers anymore there is some snow only in the slopes on that side it's even worse because that's the sunny side there is really everywhere green This is what we see the end of March, beginning of April. Now it's end of December. Absolutely recommend to come up to Meinichen even if you don't want to ski or snowboard. It is absolutely worth it to have a drink or a meal here while enjoying the spectacular view on the three famous Eiger Mönch and Jungfrau peaks. It's crazy how many people are here and even though the conditions are really not that good incredible how many people are here I'm really enjoying now to come up here it's always beautiful and waiting for a few more days for some more snow to really get to that snowboarding back now if you are up in the mountains in Switzerland you gotta try one of their popular winter drinks Lumbumba. It's a typical winter winter drink, and they made it really strong for me. It's a little bit more rummy than cacao. <laughs> Switzerland, you can't miss out trying one of their famous cheese dishes. What is this? Ah, Berner Oberländische Käsebrät. <laughs> Bread with a lot of Swiss cheese on it. If you prefer to sit in the warm, there is also a restaurant where you can warm up while enjoying your meal with the mountain view. The sun is going away, so it's now time to go down again. It's really cold now. Some places this uh, gondola is heated, but not here. famous Nord Wall, Nordwand. Many people are coming here in the summer to climb here up and uh, yeah it's a pretty dangerous one actually. Oh and now the gondola exactly stops here. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Off road. Off road. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yes. Pow, pow, pow. <laughs> Look nice. Oh my god, with the snowboard, it sucks. Icy snow, dude. What are you doing? It's definitely hurting to, to ride uh, with these conditions. Bumps. All these bumps and everything. I just really didn't want to hurt my hips or my joints today. It's much more enjoyable to just come up, have a nice walk, enjoy the sun and the view and the hot rink and yeah, waiting for the snow till we have some good snow to go snowboarding. Mm -hmm. Grindelwald has one main street where you can find many shops, restaurants, street food and souvenirs. <laughs> 